It's news. <laughs> See, I just came back from Ghana. Really? And I want to share this dance that everyone was doing over there. Um, we're here today at the county ground, the home of football, for an adult daycare centre festival. This is our second festival. Um, and the guys uh, that you can see behind us are having a great time. We've got about six or seven different daycare centres here today, varying different levels of abilities. And they're all having a good time, they're all having good fun, socialising and I think it's good for their physical fitness and their health. They get out and they uh, just get involved in doing a bit of football. Alex, that's how you do my zo, zo, zo. Let me see you go, go. Kill me, talk me this. Nobody wanna see you rising. And when they do, they don't even like it. They just wanna see you deep in crisis. Drive us off, you don't need the lasses. Holla her, she can even ride it. Go ahead, move your feet just like this. Then he showed me the latest. We walk over the haters. Now what you do, man, you zoom to. Zoom to, zoom to. Now watch me do my zoom to. Zoom to, zoom to. Now watch me do my zoom to. This is our second visit. We went to the original first um, Saturday tournament where we were runners up and then all the lads went on to watch Watford beat Barnsley which was an excellent day. Norfolk Day Centre is what we class as a mixed um, group. Uh, we have everybody from people with learning disabilities, physical disabilities and dementia. The group that I've got here today, the seven lads, have learning disabilities um, and mental health issues. Um, we do have a game we play every Tuesday from 11 till 12 and basically this is just snowballed from that. your life and things enjoy your life and things because it's your life so make sure you give thanks to the whole high and thing so that dupes come limpsy i don't care about a hater um, my name's howard sartin i work for an organization a charity called guidepost trust uh, our team the griffins have been together for about a year it was just started with occasional training sessions in the gym and it's really blossomed from there we started with four players we've now got 11 in the squad and we play every Saturday and there's such enthusiasm within the team and we feel like we've come a long way in particularly in the past six months yeah, yeah. Life can be a roller coaster. Ooh. Taking you round and round again. Sometimes when you feel it's over. Ooh. 
And you feel sad and down again Get up, put this tune on and dance Let's add on to You know you want to So let's add on to Head, shoulders, knees and toes free Oh yeah, shashi wo wo, shashi wo wo free Migrants gang, man I like your show me Fort Worker, Leiden, House, Daycare Centre Side, uh, with another staff member and their basis on it is to make them enjoy the day of their football while they uh, train. We try our best to help them just to slightly improve them and so they get in that bit of uh, athletic to them and exercise and anything else included in the football wise. Centre. The group that we're bringing up is normally um, an art history and science group and we got the invitation to come up for a football tournament so they were very keen. guys hopefully learning from that in team play and enjoying it all round. I recommend it very well lead to others and that others should jo join in because it is a very good day and well organised and run. You guys enjoyed the day? Yeah they thoroughly enjoyed it, yeah really good, smiles all the time. So that's good. Yeah. And would they recommend, would you recommend this to the day? So Definitely, I think it's great. Yeah. I can wholeheartedly recommend taking part in a day like this. This has been terrific for me on the sidelines watching the players, but to look at the expression on the players' faces, they really enjoyed today. A lot of them, their fitness has really upped recently. There's just this real sense of camaraderie in the team, and it's just lovely to watch them when they make a good tackle or when they score, and we're really bonding together as a team. And it's thanks to days like that we can do this. If anybody's watching this video, I would highly recommend it. My lads absolutely love it. Pretty much for the whole month. The talk is when is the next tournament. We can't wait. They've met loads of great people um, and we have just such a wonderful time. And it's not about the winning, it is the taking part, uh, as I say, and, the, and we just love it. And just from a really selfish point of view, I love it as well because I get out the day centre. <laughs> Bring me down. 